actually think it's very exciting. Um, I think it gives more choice to the employee. Um, uh, I think that these days we are all so used to being treated like a consumer and uh, having uh, choices um, and having our preferences taken account of. And that is very prevalent in the consumer world and much less so when it comes to our experience as an employee. So I think the digitization of, of parts of that experience um, uh, helps to do that. Um, I think that it's also very positive in terms of helping us who are in HR um, who are tasked with building workforces because um, uh, I don't know about you guys but I've been asked to, for example, recruit you know, 300 developers um, this year so far and it's so tough, the war um, for talent, it's, it's a cliche, but it's so tough. And if digital tools can allow us to um, uh, look for uh, freelance um, uh, colleagues or employees in different uh, locations, then that's only a great thing um, from a HR perspective. Um, and then finally, I think that, that the digital um, experience helps to uh, our employees to collaborate more, um, and that can only be a good thing um, in terms of innovation. There are also obviously some downsides, but I think overall, I think it's a positive thing. Well, thank you very much. And then, because I just made the introduction, you, you want to talk perhaps not so much about the downsides, but about some of the challenges you face. You take a topic like recruitment, I think we all recognize that the war for talent is, is on again. Could you say a few words about your practical experiences with that? That might be interesting for the audience. Sure. So, um, for instead of recruitment, I might choose um, uh, a slightly different uh, topic, if that's okay. So, yeah. um, uh, so, for example, one of the um, one of the uh, issues that we had at OVO um, was as we scaled, um, we wanted to uh, ensure that we were being innovative and um, that we were uh, keeping some of the things that gave us our competitive advantage, um, and also that we were able to attract the, the right talent. Um, and so uh, we decided to um, uh, look at OD and move from uh, siloed hierarchies to a cross-functional network of teams. Yeah. Um, and we were um, uh, using tools like Slack and so forth to help to digitize that type of experience. Mm -hmm. Um, and one of the things that, that we didn't do very well was we didn't think through um, how we were going to um, uh, use digital uh, or, or digital experiences to link, um, I guess, the experience of the um, uh, organisation as a whole. So things like um, uh, trying to empower our cross-functional teams without having thinking through how to connect um, and align them at scale. So um, sometimes I think we went too fast with our um, appetite to try out new things um, without really um, thinking through some of the wider consequences. Very good, thank you. Uh, as a CEO, I just heard, heard your, your story, of course. Um, when, the, when the product in this exciting environment of London where you work, and, and uh, I, I know it well for my uh, very good food, is getting enabled. It's a vibrant environment that certainly adds to, to, to an exciting proposition when it comes to. to